All right, so today I'm going to show you the new math system that we started using. Um, we started using it a few months ago. Uh, we stopped using CTC math. We discovered that there um, was some glitches in the system we didn't like, and an online system really wasn't working for us, and I wanted to see my kids um, actually completing the work and stuff like that. So we went with a book system, and um, there are a lot of great recommendations out there from fellow homeschoolers, um, but we decided to go with Learn Math learn math fast um, because it didn't have any fluff and it wasn't super expensive um, like Math Mammoth or Math UC or some of the other ones um, that I can't quite remember at the moment but we decided to go with learn math fast and uh, today I'm gonna show you what learn math fast looks like and why we went with it okay so we chose the learn math fast system because it was no fluff, it just got straight down to the math, and it teaches you by actually doing each problem out. So the lesson is just someone doing problems step by step, and that's all it is. Um, in the beginning, they use manipulatives um, to show them the addition. I started uh, chapter one, volume one, chapter one, page one with uh, my 10 year old. She obviously got through um, the beginning lessons fairly quickly, but you can see how it shows you how to use the pennies as manipulatives. And then there's a worksheet at the end. And then there's a 30 second test, which we don't do. I just don't believe in timed testing. Once they get the concept, we move on. If they don't have to do every problem over here to move on, that's okay. We didn't want that spider. And it just, it's literally step by step. So you may be able to do more than one lesson in a day or week or whatever. It takes what it takes. And then my daughter right now is... It teaches you how to figure things out to do things in your head. It shows different methods of doing things on um, that you can either take it or leave it. Um, so I like it how you can you can really do what applies to you, what steps apply to you. Um, she didn't get this far. Where did she go? I feel like she was in for some reason thinking she was beginning multiplying. Oh, adding and subtracting by tens and you use dimes. So I really like the way this is flowing. Will we stick with it forever? I don't know. Maybe I'd like to. We did CTC math. We did Life of Fred. Um, I really think we're going to be using this along with um, the online game, um, Prodigy Math game. Um, and I really feel like we're going to stick with this. So and here we go. Multiplication. Here we go. So chapter three test multiplication and division. Again, they bring the pennies back from manipulatives. And it goes all the way to um, place values, uh, money, division, division with remainders. Um, I like how it is showing you and then div dividing with decimals. Um, I really feel like this lesson would benefit my son, actually. Maybe I shouldn't have started him on volume two. But what's done is done, and we're working on division now um, just by doing division problems. It's more of a, it's not more of a he doesn't know how to do it. He just doesn't have the faith in himself to do it. Very, very simple. Units of measurement. And of course, it does have the answers for each worksheet in the back, which I like, but I don't like, because sometimes I wonder. Luckily, I asked my kids to do the workout so I can see that they did something and didn't just copy the answer down so they know how to do it. So that's volume one. Um, and this is volume two, which is where I started uh, my 12-year-old on. Um, he finished sixth grade in public school with a lot of gaps. 
And as you can see, it's the same thing. It starts with fractions, um, reading fractions on a ruler, mixed numbers, um, decimals, percentages, fractions, um, negative, and then it starts into um, negative numbers. And that's where volume two ends. So you can see, again, it uses money as a manipulative. Very, very straightforward. Which is what I liked about it. So we, this year, are using this um, in conjunction with um, Prodigy. So we'll have them do... Um, lesson in this and if there's something they still don't get then we look on YouTube for videos and stuff like that because um, maybe they just need it to explain it in a different way but we haven't had that problem yet um, again with the worksheets if you notice they don't do the timed tests in this one that's just for the addition and subtraction um, and this is a, a bit of a smaller volume and they have this is not obviously not the last volume um, they have larger ones. I'm going to link below um, to where you can buy these from. There's two options, either um, edusense.com, which is a great educational website, um, and also off of Amazon. Um, I believe if you have Amazon Prime, then it's totally worth ordering it from Amazon. Otherwise, I would personally order it from Edusense um, and definitely um, take a peek around their website as well because it's really cool. Um, if you click the links below, we do benefit from it. Um, the company the company pays us if you purchase something from using our link. Um, it doesn't affect the cost to you at all. Um, it's more like a referral thing. Kind of like a, hey, tell them we sent you. So this is what we're using for my son, and I feel like he will move on to the third book sometime this year as well. I feel like he's almost done with this one. So there's volume two. When we get volume three in, I will be more than happy to make a video about it. But I wanted to show you these two. I really think they're going to work well for us and um, maybe something that'll work well for you too. So I will link below um, to where you can purchase these off of Edusense and Amazon in the description. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, we'd love to hear from you.